Hi, my name is Mark Grice. Today we're going to be looking at the Promax and all its capabilities. So I'll give you a quick tour of the circuit board. So on the right hand side you have your mains. So you can either have it three phase 400 volts or single phase 230 volts. You have a selector link there to select the voltage. You've got a neutral connection, an earth connection, you've got your motor connections. There's a 230 volt motor brake output, 230 volt flashing light output, open and close status limit indicators. You have a push button connection. So this board can have mechanical limits or digital limits and it's selectable by a dip switch. You have your stop circuit and safety edge circuit. You have a low level photocell and a high level photocell connection. There is a 24 volt DC supply at 700 milliamps and a 24 volt AC supply. So the two voltages um, share between the 700 milliamps. You've also got plug-in connections. So there is a um, traffic light board, wireless safety edge card, remote control and loop protector port and you've got various dip switches for different functions. So this particular setup is um, a digital limit version as you can see the dip switch is set for the encoder. So to set the limits you have a program up button, a program down button, an up and a down button. So to set the upper limit, you hold the program up button in until the LED illuminates above. Once it's illuminated, you can run the door to the position you want it. This is always in dead man up and down. Where you're happy with the position, if you then press the program up button once, the LED will flash and go out that is now your top limit set so to set the bottom limit you just repeat the process you hold the program down button until the led lights up run it down to the position you want it and then press the program button again once the led will flash and go out and that is now your limit set So the Pro Max has um, two banks of dip switches, one to nine and one and two separately. So dip switch one is if you want auto close, you just flick the switch on and then you've got a variable pot there that you can set up to four minutes. You've got dead man open, dead man close facility. So if you don't have any safeties on the door, you can just put dip switch three on for your dead man close. You can have a three second pre-flash um, before the door moves and uh, there's a no brake facility so if you don't want a motor brake you can flick that on you can have no stop in opening um, so basically if the door is going up the stop is inactive you've got then the test open test close fine adjustment and a select between digital limits and mechanical limits So the photocell connections are here. You have a 24 volt test facility of the photocell. You have a standard regulated 24 volt DC supply at 700 milliamps. So usually with our photocell, you'd have the brown wire in the plus, the blue wire in the negative. And then just below it, it says SEC OP SEC CL. So this is the facility for a high level photocell or a low level photocell. So if you want a low level photocell with stop and reverse, your normally closed contact goes in the middle and the bottom terminal. So again, with our photocell, it's usually the black and the white. If you've got a high level photocell, you will put in the top and the bottom terminal. If the high level photocell is broken, it will stop and retract at 50 mil. So 
So the panel has the facility for two types of safety edge. You can have the optical edge version or an 8K2 ohm resistive edge version. So with the optical system, your brown wire will go in your plus 24 volts. Your white wire will go in your minus 24 volts and the green wire where it says edge will go in the top terminal here. So the Promax has a facility for a plug-in wireless safety edge card. So this generally works on an 8K 2 ohm resistive safety edge. So to program it, you hold the program button until you hear a beep. Then let go. You then hold the program button on the bottom transmitter. You get a beep. And then press the program once more on the card to confirm. You will get your double beep and now the pairing is complete. So I hope you found this video useful. Um, if you need to know any more information about the Pro Max, if you just go to lard.co.uk, you can get the PDF documents there.